The first time I worked with Will Taylor was sometime around 1987 or 8, it was some time ago now. Uh, Chris Searles was on drums, and I believe it was Glenn Rex Sash on guitar, and Will was playing jazz viola, uh, and I was playing bass and struggling a little bit with reading jazz charts. I was kind of coerced into that gig by my good friend Chris Searles, the drummer, and partly because he knew that I was primarily a rock and roll bass player, especially at the time, and he was basically trying to push me like good friends do. And it worked and I was very intimidated <laughs> by Will and his chops and the charts that I had to read. But we got through it just fine and I remember it uh, being a, a very exhausting occasion for me. <laughs> A couple of strings attached performances I've been able to be in the audience for to, to listen just as a, strictly as a listener. Uh, the, the couple of things that I really appreciated were the range of the singers, the way that, that the singers, you know, there was a rotation of singers uh, for a particular show, whether it was a Led Zeppelin show or, or the Pink Floyd. I mean, just really impressive, beautiful singing. And the way that Will can twist a guitar part harmonically and texturally to the strings, that's, it's a beautiful thing and it's, and it's very unique and it's a, it's a hell of a skill and it's great arranging. And um, I particularly enjoyed some of the Zeppelin stuff, so hearing some of those Jimmy Page guitar parts played on viola. I came to Austin in 1984. I've been here for 30 years now, and uh, I've made many great friends, had many great experiences all across the board, played all kinds of music. Uh, I played bass in a band called Joe Rockhead. I played bass in the Killer Bees. My first professional gig was uh, playing bass for a band leader named Dan Del Santo in the mid 80s. And, uh, and since then I've done many things. I have played and toured and recorded with Alejandro Escovero, uh, Monty Montgomery, Trish Murphy, uh, an Argentine artist named Federico Albel uh, for a few years in the early 2000s. And um, uh, I was cellist in the Temple Symphony Orchestra for a few years and many other things. Hello, I'm Steve Bernal. I'm a professional cellist. I've been part of the Austin music community for 30 years, and I've known Will a long time. And we ask that you become a patron of Will Taylor and Strings Attached, so that he can continue to propagate the great work and the wonderful events that are possible. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Good.